This is a banana leaf. And it leaves a whisper of sweetness when you steam something in it, like pork and shrimp dumplings, called bun bot lok. To caramelize the pork, oil, and sugar. And you can use any neutral oil for this. I want that sugar to dissolve a little bit in the oil, almost make it like a syrup. Shallots and garlic. It's turned golden brown so quickly and it's ready for the pork. Fish sauce. And now that plump shrimp. Mmm. That filling smells so good. I'm using tapioca starch. And this dough, it's gonna look white, but then once I steam it, it's gonna be a translucent dough. And a little veg oil. The trick with using tapioca starch is using boiling hot water. That's enough kneading. This is the texture that I'm looking for. Yeah, it's moist. That's good. And this dumpling is gonna be wrapped up in the banana leaf. <laughs> So that dough, remember it's so sticky. Use a tablespoon, grease it up with some vegetable oil. And this will help it slide off nicely after it's been steamed. This is time consuming. Imagine making 60 of these, 100 of them. The emperor probably had like 100 cooks in the kitchen. And there are rumors that the emperors were really picky eaters, demanded something different every single day. So I'm guessing this is kind of one of those dishes where the cooks had to constantly be innovating. And look at that. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Just a few more to make. I'm just gonna let them steam for a little while. And it smells like bamboo from the steamer. They look so cute. And the color of the banana leaf, it's changed quite a bit now into like a nice darker moss green color. I'm gonna untie my little gift. And wow, look at that tapioca dough. Clear dough so I can see my pork belly and shrimp. This is gonna be good. And it needs just a little scallion to top it off. And a dip in the nook chum sauce, Vietnam's favorite dressing or dipping. Mm. That tapioca dough has 
like a hint of sweetness from the banana leaf. And then you chew into it, really nice chew. And then the sweet caramelized shrimp and pork just jumps out. Oh my goodness.